Hey, hi guys, Tuho here again. I'm actually back here to show you how to um, password protect because my other video sucked and you really couldn't hear me at all. But now I have a better camera system and here it goes. I'm gonna show you how to password protect first. And then there is a um, there is a online viewer who asked me a question uh, asking if you could take the password off and the answer is yes. It's really simple and I'm going to show you guys step to step how to do it and what what uh, what you should do and some things that you shouldn't want that uh, some things you wouldn't want to do. Okay so first here's how you password protect. I made a sample folder here already. Make it simple. Okay so you click on that and I made a folder in here too. What you want to do first is uh, make a folder. Any, any folder would do. Any name would do. And Next, you want to make a folder inside that, that main folder that you made called sample or, or whatever. And then put the things you want in here. For example, I'll put my uh, my puppy's pictures in there. And then I renamed it as something else. That's what you want to do. When you have your root folder inside the main folder, you want to name it something else so that when you extract the file, it won't uh, it won't uh, save over your main folder. So that's what so that's that's why you want want it as a different name. So here it goes. Um, by now you should have uh, you should have downloaded 7-zip already. And when you do, you'll get an option here called 7-zip, and it should have uh, an arrow. Highlight that. Go to uh, an archive and add it to the archive. And a screen like this should pop up called Add to Archive. And up here is the name, all of these other stuff here. But the three main things on here are uh, uh, the archive format, the password, and encryption method. First time, The first time you download 7-zip, it will be on 7-z. When it's uh, on there, I want you to change it to zip uh, file extension and put in the password, which anything that you want to, but just try to remember it. And then this will be on AES-256 the first time you download 7-zip and I'm gonna want you to or I mean you're gonna need it to change it to zip crypto and when you're done just click OK the zipped folder should be in here drag it out do whatever you want with it put it anywhere hide it okay. but the important part is uh, or at least for me the cool things about this is that you know how when you extract a file, you'll see the pictures like this. The screen will pop up showing you what the picture is. But when you password protected, you won't see the picture at all. So they won't get to see what it is. And if they can't figure out the password, then it's too bad for them. It's, it's going to block them for uh, opening that file or downloading it to uh, their, their hard drive or whatever. And then another cool part about um, uh, 7-Zip protecting your files by passwords is that when you try to enter it, they won't get anything at all. They won't see anything. They'll just get two empty folders. <laughs> so yeah, and now I'm going to show you how to get rid of the password. Okay, so you're in the zipped file and anywhere on the folder, as long as it's a white spot dot line dash invincible <laughs> on the screen right click on it and there should be an option saying remove password and you see this and if you re remember your password put it down click ok or push enter when you're done and it should refresh itself and when you uh, go inside the pa the, the pictures are still um, undefined and you won't be able to see them but if you click on them you'll, you'll be able to see it and view them and yep, that's basically how you put password on and remove them. Well, this has been an episode of Two Hua. Thanks for watching and rate, comment, subscribe, do whatever. <laughs> Thanks for watching and see you guys another day. Goodbye.